in this problem we are given uh, four digits uh, single digits from 0 to 9 so like this uh, let's say 3 2 1 5 so we will be always given four digits and we have to form time and time should be in this format h h m m so you see four digits are being used and you can use uh, these four digits in any of these four positions either for h h m m and you don't have to duplicate that so you cannot use three multiple times and ignore one of that so you have to use each of these exactly once and then form a time and then uh, there will be multiple possibilities here you can have any of the four digits here you can have any of the remaining three digits so four permutation possibilities are there so four cross three cross two cross one that is 24 so we have to return the largest time so by largest uh, we have to see that time starts from 00, 00. or colon 00. this is the smallest time and the largest time is 2359 so all time will be between this and this including this so we have to form the maximum possible time for example we can form here 1 2 3 5 this is one time then we can form uh, 2 3 using 2 3 and then 5 1 so you see that clearly this is the larger than this one and in fact for this problem this should be the largest one but there may be scenarios where you cannot form a valid time for example you need two digits to form the hour clock and that should be smaller than 24 let's say you have 3 3 3 3 now no time is possible it will be 33 hour 33 minute which is invalid so in that case we will return empty string otherwise if it's valid we will return the largest time so let's see how we can do that so we will try for all the possibilities so we have four places to fill h h m m so uh, in fact if you fill three places you automatically know what should be the fourth one whichever digit is left so we can have uh, some loop i equal to 0 to 3 including this so this index is 0 1 2 3 j equal to 0 to 3 k equal to 0 to 3 and uh, the fourth one we automatically know so their sum is 3 2 5 plus 1 6 so we will see which index we have picked the first one which index we have picked the second one third one and subtract from 6 so uh, here we will have Uh, let's call this a a i the string representation of this and concatenate with this one a j so this is the hour h h and then m mm m will be a k and a 6 minus i minus j minus k so here this operation let's say denotes concatenation we are concatenating it into one string and we have to check that these should not be equal so when i is equal to j or j equal to k or k equal to i then we will not continue we will skip those values so uh, and then what we will do we will have a global uh, answer or result and whenever we find a better value we update it so first we will check if this hh should lie it should be less than 24 if it's more than 24 then we will not update it so if hh is less than 24 similarly minute should be less than 60 and hh mm the string this one is less is, is more than result so we found a better solution better valid time then we update the result and finally we will return the result so what is the time complexity here this will run for four times four times four times so o of 64 this is the time complexity so you can assume it to be constant time and a space it's same as the result variable we are having a few more string so its length can be at max uh, two characters here also two characters 
so four characters and one for result so it's also constant time so let's write write the code for this this should be pretty simple So uh, what will be the time here? HHMM. So let's keep a separate variable. and the answer matches so let's submit and the solution is accepted so let's do this same thing in java and python and the java solution is also accepted finally we will do it in python 3 
and the python solution is also accepted